I, I think you know as well as I do, a lot of the departments um, go through phases, right? Where I wouldn't talk to a single person on the department I worked for, uh, you know, that yeah, your crew. Just, just because there's so much backbiting and it's hard. I mean, if you hear somebody talking shit on another person, you're not going to want to talk to that person about anything because right. likely that they're the going to be doing that. It's crazy. All of a sudden you'll be on a crew that's just like family and they go fishing and yep. hunting and boating together. Yep. And then the next shift you change to all of a sudden you don't even want to sit in the day room together. Yeah. So, um, chief Fox gave me the, the opportunity to run a run with this program. And we built a robust health and wellness program. That is, I, I think it, I've had a lot of people come and say that it's been helpful and, um, you know, your feedback, there's just been a lot of really good feedback. Um, and it was, it was a labor of love, man. I have a lot of respect. So did you guys, and, did you put this whole care. book together with your team? Yeah. With Salt Lake. So a lot of it is, uh, the curriculum and also to limit the amount of shit that their family has to deal with. Cause they didn't sign up for the job. Right? right. So, and they don't get the glory either. No, they don't. Um, and that man, that's not something that they're aware of when they sign up to be a spouse to somebody that does a job like this. Uh, I don't think that we're, any of us are really aware of what we're signing up for when we sign up for it. So 20% have made it up the difference, I think, for the, you know, abdication of responsibility on the 80% side. And mm -hmm. it's the, the Matthew principle, right? Um, wildland fires are some of the most dangerous things that we deal with just because of the nature of weather and uh, fuels and, and slopes and how they all kind of can be chaotic and do crazy things and you know one second going one way the next second a few miles towards you you know or on you mm -hmm. um so anyway we were part of task force team two uh and we were sent to help initially with the lilac fires uh by seaside california and we were protecting uh a racehorse ranch um some of them were million dollar breeded uh bred racehorses mm -hmm. that competed in kentucky derby um so we we're doing spot fire checks uh and it was the end of the night 